be a, a decent fit for Guilty, considering that she's a Dalson player, and there's some similarities between the two characters. She has, uh, I feel like, the dexterity to do all the fancy combos. I think she is legit a uh, character. I think she's pretty good. I think a lot of people are looking for these max damage scenarios in V-Trigger, but the real strength is going to be, like, crouching medium kick V-Trigger. Or a standing medium kick V trigger, right? A standing medium punch. It's like one of her far normals in the V trigger. Think about Laura. Her best activation is like medium kick. Medium kick. Right. So it's yeah. got to be a, a normal that's further away. Uh, max damage scenarios are important, but if you can create high damage and stun or mix up scenarios off of like a crouching medium kick V trigger, then you're going to be powerful. Yeah, there's been you know, a lot of uh, complaint in the Twitterverse about you know dying in three mix ups. Yeah. That's probably something you can do with Minot with the orb setups. So for sure, she is one of those characters that can do that. She has the tools to do it. Oh, wake up, standing light kick. That's her three frame button. Uh, in case you guys are curious, sends the heavy orbs. You can tell which orbs are which by looking at the wow. That was a crazy far drill. By looking at where they are on, on her body. So the orbs on the top, the top left and top right are the light orbs. The two in the middle are the medium orbs, and the two on the bottom are the uh, heavies. So you can tell which uh, the Minot player has let go or not let go of just by looking at them. I believe uh, the left side is the punches and the yeah, right side, side is the punches. Yeah. Antier? Nice. That's one thing about the orb. Uh, when you put the orb behind your opponent and resummon it, if they happen to get hit by it, you can juggle off of it. Uh-oh. Miss combo off the drill. CA for Chip is the threat, though. Yeah. She is, uh, she is one of the best critical arts in the game. It's, it's super good. Uh, any CA that's like one hit is really good because it's hard to be reversal a lot of the time. On top of which, uh, it's four frames on startup and it has crazy range. Yeah, it, so. it, it goes hell up. Like this range right here, it would hit. Uh, it's super far. See that standing medium punch nice. that Guilty's hitting over and over. Super good button. Meteor here, maybe? No, she wanted the drill. Yeah, and that, that sweep from her is super good. It's really hard to punish. Yeah, orb sweep is negative 16 if I recall correctly, but it's it at max range. There's, I think you really have to think about your punish. Probably Ken Kentatsu. But yeah, I, maybe a or something. Oh, missed the media, and that'll oh, do there it. Is. We get to see it. Hard, I think we're gonna see a lot of this because he doesn't get that much from uh, Ex Soul Throw. Yeah, the the Soul Throw and the Ex Orbs. Uh, Follow-ups are mostly used to either kill in a round or for extra damage off juggles and stuff. Yeah. She has a really good knockdown. It's the medium and heavy uh, soul like throw, the air one, or the, not the soul throw, the orb round throw. Yeah. The air one, that one gives you a ton of Fight. knockdown advantage, and there's some pretty easy stuff you can set up off of it. Answer so your jab. We could, see, we could see maybe some, some good set play come out of that later, but I think for now people are really focusing on the neutral and, and really playing with the orb. Yeah, her buttons are great, and when she has an orb behind you, the threat of the orb is so powerful. Activation. Yeah, and even she doesn't, even if she doesn't have orb, her frame data without orb is actually insane. You really look at it. She has uh, like stuff like her roundhouse, uh, plus one on block. Nice, Ooh, nice soul throw. Catch. Yeah, and see, like I, I don't really approve of using the ex soul throw because it doesn't do that much damage. It's an excellent anti-air, though. It, it pretty much eats up everything. She has good anti-air tools, but that's probably the best. Reflect? Oh, no. It oh, get no. It gets hit by it. Yeah. I, don't, I don't love whipping the fierce. Uh, it's a super slow button. I do like the roundhouse. Yeah, and it being uh, at, at a downward angle, so like hitting their feet means that you can jump it. You Is know, a double KO? Oh, no. what? what? I had no idea. Right. I didn't know what happened. Man, Guilty is so calm, too. I would have I would thought I would have lost. Yeah, that was wild. Uh, yeah, she has great orb. Her orb normals are super good. If she throws the orb, she loses it, and it kind of has different normals that are a little better for combo potential and stuff. So she's a really interesting character. She is sort of a stance character in that way. Yeah, a little bit. I can see that. Good slide under. I like it. She has a really good slide. Uh, it's got some good range. It's really active, and that's, yeah, the, the orb goes straight forward on the hitbox, so it's not a great anti-air. I think the idea from Guilty was that the orb recall was going to hit Ken, and then she was going to CA a while here. Yeah, this, this is going to happen. This is going to happen. Sometimes uh, you just get your offense going, and her defensive options are very weak, so it's easy to run you over. If you're uh, Ken here, that's pretty much your goal. Yeah, slide is good. And not only that, but when you have orbs out, you can combo off the slide pretty easily. 
I'm actually really surprised she doesn't get a uh, she doesn't get any V skill or V trigger meter from reflecting. Yeah, only absorbing. But I think that's also something that we might see a lot of Minot players go for the future, comboing into that V skill to get some extra meter. Oh yeah, it's also a great anti air, good combo ender as you mentioned. Fine, there it is. Mobility. It's really interesting to watch Guilty's Minot because most Minots I've seen are crown based, but because she is a Dalsum player, she knows the spacing on those drills, uh, which I've not seen a lot of other people use. It. Yeah, she's already used to playing that that half screen neutral. That's not really. Oh wow! Off the confirmed light kick. I like it. Ooh, almost you... got a combo off of it. All right, we're starting to figure stuff out. So you're talking about a second ago that more practical confirm into uh, V trigger. Oh, oh, with the throw, this is dangerous. Oh, the drill, right. that one was very high. Uh, chip, chip is a threat. Yeah. Nice work. Alright, I guess that means we get to see more Minot. I'm stoked. I, I enjoy this character. Quite a bit. I think this character is great. And she is really interesting. Uh, you know, she is sort of... So different from every other character that I feel like lots of people are just happy about that. And I think that's what's cool about getting new characters, is that we can get a design like this that's so funky. Although I do miss Rose, to be honest with you. I know lots of people don't miss Rose, but <laughs> Rose is a tight character. I think you, you and a few other people, but Rose, cool, Rose is a tight character. You're absolutely right. But this character is is, is really taking a grip on me. I, th I, I enjoy this character a ton. I, I wonder why. Why is that? I don't know. I think a lot of people... Dude, I was streaming and everybody was like, here's a slow motion gif of her super. Oh, right. Yeah. And I was like, look, <laughs> if you want to watch that, you can watch that when your parents leave. You you know, you turn off the... Close the shutters. When it's just you alone, you can watch that slow motion. I don't want to watch it with people. It feels weird, man. That's hell of it. Not, not a fan of that. Yeah. Me not either. I'm not going to lie. Some, some part of it is that she's like fake Egyptian or whatever from... Whatever Egypt is in the Street Fighter universe. Look, man. You can watch it in alone. Oh, standing medium punch. So good, man. I did I like gotta check. I haven't looked if the orb normals are disjointed in her box. Oh yeah, I'm not sure actually. Um, I'd imagine. I'm because it's probably it's probably really easy to just put a hitbox on the orb itself. Okay. Wake up light kick into the D skill right into CA. Watch this alone. Close the curtain. I can't imagine Rose being like, yeah, good work. <laughs> like, <laughs> Rose is like, whatever, dude. <laughs> Do your job. Rose has RBF for sure. Man, that combo does so much damage for air crush counter. Uh, not dead. Boy, yeah, no, no more. I'll do it. All right. That last was not even a combo. It was double down strong counter hit, but we are into the last round. Stage Final transition. Round. Noodles in play. Fight. Oh wow, no way punish there. Yeah, and I missed uh, drill from Guilty. Still got punished on the landing frame. Oh wow, he's facing these really well, but doesn't confirm. Accidentally gets the DP. Dang, that was cool juggle. Oh, he's going for the reset into the drill instead of soul throw. I like that. Oh, preemptive roundhouse anti-air. A roundhouse is great. It shoots the orb up at a kind of diagonal angle. Oh, no anti-air. Bait is oh, a throw. Needs about one more for CA. Yeah. Spencer. I think this is peace. No, he has 950. Oh, she did. Yeah, she's 950 if I recall correctly. Yeah, so. 950, but still got peace out by the CA. Good work. So Guilty showing off some Minot. Two-minute Minot.